In this video, I'm gonna show you how we can use stepper component of Metroid UI. So stepper component is used to show an stepwise progress. Okay, so it is stepper and it's imported from Metroid UI core. Let me add it here. So it's it will not show anything because we need to add some steps. And inside each step, we need to add to our step level. So suppose it is register your name. The step is also imported from here, material by code. Okay. Let me add two more steps here. The second one is suppose the name is uh and uh, register your email register your email and the third one is suppose it is click to finish click to finish now let's check okay so this is the stepper component so here you can see that by default the one is selected this is the first step so here in the stripper we can also pass one props it's called active step so it starts from zero if i give it zero then the first one will be selected if i give one then the second one is selected it says that the first one is done and if i give two then it says that the third one is selected we can also change it to select the first one and also we can mark any other step as completed suppose i want to mark the last one as a completed then i need to mark it as completed true true then it will mark the last one as completed but the first one is selected you can also mark one step level as optional so for that we need to use this optional props and here i need to pass one typography so inside this typography you can't like uh, add any any text suppose optional step then this one will be shown as an optional step we can change the typography to any other variant so if i use variant as the caption then it will be shown as a caption let me remove this optional from here and here we can also give pass one another props it's called alternative level and if i pass it then it will be shown at the bottom not to the right of these indicators we can also disable one uh, stepper so for that we need to use one props it's called disabled so if i mark it is as disabled then this one is uh, marked as the disabled we have one more types of stepper it's called non-linear and non-linear will mark only the the, the the active step that we are working here so if the active step is one then it will mark only the the first one so if i mark it as two then it will only select the last one so if we remove non-linear then it shows that these are done and this one is currently we are selecting we have one more component it's called step button so if i use the button here then it will be converted to a button so you can see that we can click on this we can also change the orientation of this stepper so for that i need to use this orientation so if i give it as vertical then it will be changed to vertical the other props will work similarly only thing is that it's vertical so you can also add few more step levels it will just add it to the bottom of these other steps so that's all for now 
if you love this video please like it and please subscribe to our channel and if you have any question please drop one comment below thanks bye